The C-SPAN networks bring you long-form public affairs programming from the nation's capital and are a public service of your television provider. C-SPAN, created by cable. Great. Good afternoon. I'd like to say a few words and then take your questions. I have now seen Director Comey's letter to Congress. We are 11 days out from perhaps the most important national election of our lifetimes. Voting is already underway in our country. So the American people deserve to get the full and complete facts immediately. The director himself has said he doesn't know whether the emails referenced in his letter are significant or not. I'm confident, whatever they are, will not change the conclusion reached in July. Therefore, it's imperative that the Bureau explain this issue in question, whatever it is, without any delay. So I look forward to moving forward uh, to focus on the important challenges facing the American people, winning on November 8th, and working with all Americans to build a better future for our country. Thank you. Any of your advisors heard from uh, Comey or anyone else at the FBI today? And are you concerned at all that these new emails that they say they've found will in any way reveal classified information that you sent or received? No, I, I, we have not been contacted by anyone. Uh, first, we knew about it is, I assume, when you knew about it, when uh, this letter uh, sent to Republican uh, members of the House was released. So we don't know the facts, which is why we are calling on the FBI to release all the information uh, that it has. Uh, even Director Comey noted that this new information may not be significant. So let's get it out. You have 11 days to go. What would you say to a voter who right now will be seeing you and hearing what you're saying, saying, I didn't trust her before, I don't trust her anymore right now, and they're heading to the ballot box tomorrow. You know, I think people a long time ago made up their minds about uh, the emails. I think that's factored in to uh, what people think, and uh, now they're choosing a president. So I would urge everybody to get out and vote early in all the states that uh, have early voting, because I think Americans want a president who can lead our country, who can get the economy working for everyone, not just those at the top, and who can bring our country together. I offer that. I can do that. Uh, and I'm very confident that the American people know that. And uh, we're going to continue to discuss what's at stake in this election, because I believe uh, that it's one of the most consequential elections ever. Secretary Clinton. Thanks very much. Secretary Clinton, there are some reports that this, uh, these emails were found on devices that belong to your aide. Uh, Huma Abedin and her um, husband, Anthony Weiner, have you spoken to Huma? Was she able to give you any information about that? You know, we've heard these rumors. We don't know what to believe, and I'm sure there will be even more rumors. That's why it is incumbent upon the FBI to tell us what they're talking about, Jeff, because right now your guess is as good as mine, and I don't think that's good enough. So we've made it uh, very clear uh, that uh, uh, if they're going to be sending uh, this kind of letter uh, that uh, is uh, only going originally to Republican members of the House, that they need to share whatever facts they claim to have with the American people. And that's what I expect to happen. Okay, thanks very much, everybody. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.